Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you don't already know, my name is Nandi If you are new here, welcome, welcome and welcome. It is good to have you. If you are a regular subscriber, thank you so much for your support and always coming back. Now, I actually recorded this video, well I thought I did because, yes, anyway, and uh, my um, SD card is corrupt. So now I have to do it again. So basically the video that I'm doing, I saw it on a YouTuber's channel. I'm going to link a YouTube, a YouTube video on the description box below. So I'm going to be um, doing detail without using any gel or without using any heat. So I'm gonna try and stretch my hair. So it's a nice slick ponytail, but without the, the gel or the heat. Anyway, so this was also part of the um, stretching my hair. So I did the flat twist as one part of, this is how I usually stretch my hair. But I didn't leave it on because I know that she usually leaves her styles for like an hour or so. But I left mine for long, I've left mine for long because my hair is, yes, anyway. And my hair is very short, hers is quite long, so it's gonna need quite a lot of stretch. So I'm going to do another style to actually try and stretch my hair. And I was actually untangling it dry, untangling, detangle, Lord Jesus. When she was detangling her hair, she was detangling it dry. Um, not like a normal way when you use um, your water or leave-in conditioner. She was, she was doing it dry, detangling it dry. I'm looking at my, in the mirror, I've got a mirror here, so please do excuse. So the first step um, we did was detangle the hair. Um, so I detangled my hair, detangled, detangled, detangled. I used um, a brush, I will show you because I'm gonna detangle it again. I detangled my hair first and then to stretch it, I did um, the flat twist. And now I'm going to detangle it again, I'm gonna stretch it again and then. Okay, so in case you missed it, let me tell you where it all began. So it began with my hair loose without any protective style. So the first thing I did was detangle my hair dry. Why I detangle dry? Because you want your hair to be dry and if you wet your hair and detangle it, it's going to defeat the purpose because what you're trying to do is you're trying to stretch your hair. So make sure you detangle it dry. Second step was I did um, the, straight, the flat twist as my first stretching method left that on for a couple of hours and then i've just um loosened that and now what i'm doing again is detangling my hair i am using a I'm using a detangling brush and because my hair is dry guys i need to be very careful so whenever you detangle your hair dry please make sure you are very careful you are very gentle because dry hair is very brittle so it it, it breaks very easily so um, make sure you are very gentle with your hair okay so i'm just trying to get all the kinks out there you go a little bit of stretch which is good so the next brush um, I'm really using it I'm starting at the roots as you can see I'm really trying to get right in there so I can have my hair stretched from the roots so that's going to give me like that kind of like blow drying effect and then the next um, comb I took was a small tooth comb and then of course I realized that my hair is not all the way um, detangled so now I am using the white tooth comb just to get the last few kinks out of my hair and then I'm going to go back with the small um, to tooth comb just to really try and get everything stretched in there after that I'm going to be doing the second stretch which is the um, stretching with the hand with the tie band method it's called a tie band hair band method yes I love 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 this like this style really stretches your hair this is the bomb I tell you if you want to stretch your hair fast um, I'm telling you this style is absolutely amazing so you're just using the um, headband all around and that's all leaving it on for a couple of hours now I'm doing it in absolute time-lapse so everything my whole head so you see what it looks like 
and that's it complete now that's what i got after detangling my hair for the second time okay so now i'm going to leave that on for a couple of hours while that's on um i did leave it on I think for about three hours yes i left it on for about three hours and that's me looking all cray cray three hours later so now we are going to loosen my hair don't mind me chewing the gum child mm. i don't know what i was watching i don't remember what i was watching but anyway i was watching and talking to my daughter at the same time so the next step is really just taking off the elastic bands and then you're going to see how my hair is stretched child and it's a wavy i love it look at that look at that slow motion i'm telling you i love this um style Okay, so once everything is out again, I am brushing my hair, always detangle, trying to detangle as much as I can. So brushing my hair. Now what I've done is I have used the Cantu Live-In Conditioner just to try and smooth everything out. And then I've also used glycerin on my hair just to get it a nice shine. So I got everything nice and slick and I did a little tiny ponytail. Okay, so this is the next day, believe it or not. So um, I tied my hair with a satin scarf just to make sure, look at that, everything is flat. Guys, my hair, look, look at that ponytail. I know it's crazy, I know, right? Absolutely, looks so sleek, so amazing. There's no gel, no heat. I tell you, this thing is absolutely amazing. So. Now, what um, the hair that I was using for this bun was the expression. So this is the hair that was left from my last braiding I did. So I thought, oh, let me just use up the rest of it using um, just using using a bun, obviously. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be doing a bun on my hair, and my daughter decided to come and help me with this one. She was like, I need in on it. So. She's going to be doing the bun, so we did um, separate it into halves, and that's the first part. So that first part goes on to the bottom. And then the second half is gonna go on to the top to try and cover that tiny little um, braid at the top. That's my hair. Okay, so that is what she's doing. Okay, so now that's covered a bit and she's just trying to straighten the hair just to um, make sure it's all nice and straight. And then you take a little piece out of that. You're gonna use that one to um, tie everything together. So just make sure you leave it out separately. That's a piece that she's giving me. And now we are going to start with the uh, braiding method. So we're basically gonna do the three strand braid that's what she's doing there just braiding the whole hair right to the bottom I tell you at this point my daughter has become my hairstylist because yeah I love done things they do things to you so she has become quite a hairstylist I tell you Okay, so now that's all done. So we are going to take the braided hair and we're going to put it nicely in a nice tight bun. And then we're going to take the hair that you had left out. Um, she is using got to be spray. That is really just to try and tame the frizzy um, hair that is in that strand. So now she's brushing it and then she's going to be using some butter be again and then we are going to tie everything together to get, make sure we get a nice uh, tight bun that does not come off easily just the last bit over there
Ooh, look at that. Like, child, look, look, look. Oh, look at the back, guys. This is absolutely amazing. Maybe I just needed to get a little bit of a different hair color, but okay. It's all good. Right, so I did my edges off, um, offline, obviously, and now I've slayed them, and then I'm just taking it out. I didn't do much of the edge slaying. I literally just make sure that everything is, I was just make sure, um, making sure that everything is flat. So that is the final results, guys. I love these hairstyles. I'll be doing more of them. Please let me know if you like what I did. It's pretty easy, um, really easy to do. No heat, no gel. I am all the way in. I'll try some different styles as well without any gel or heat. All right, guys, I do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure you give it a huge thumbs up and don't forget your subscribe button. Until next time, ndini tandone kemakaya, nibene minim nandi.